Marathon is a unique system that operates on a solid alloy roller bar and one-piece ball cage design. It's ideal for areas of high traffic and comes in two weight capabilities for wooden or metal doors weighing up to 55 kilograms and 90 kilograms. There are many aspects about the Marathon that makes it an ideal system for many applications. The Marathon 90 range is compatible with our specialist fire door kits. Please refer to the fitting instructions for details of the routing of the door prior to installation to accommodate the guide channel and the top plates. The kit. Top assembly. Guide channel. Wall mounted stops. Lubricant. Screw pack. Nylon top plates. Nylon floor guide. The tools. Drill, tape measure, screwdriver, manual or electric, spirit level, two 13mm spanners, fitting the hangers. First we need to attach the hardware to the door. The nylon top plates must be set at the specified distance apart according to the instructions and centrally placed across the width of the door. Prepare the door according to the routing details shown in the instructions for the hanger plates. Position the hanger plates on the door and then mark out the pilot holes for the hanger screws. Drill the three pilot holes for each hanger. Using an electric or manual screwdriver, attach the hanger plates to the door using the screws provided in the kit. Installing the guide channel. Fit the steel guide channel into the pre-routed area in the bottom of the door and screw into place. Installing the track to the wall. Measure the location of the track height from the floor and clearly mark out with a pencil. Position the track against the height marking onto the wall and check it is level using a spirit level. Using a pencil, draw a line along the top of the full length of the track. Mark out the hole positions located in the track. Holding the track firmly in place, screw the first track fixing into the wall. Check the track is level again and screw the second wall fixing in place at the opposite end. Once you are happy that the track is still level, use the other screws to secure the track in place. Hanging the door on the track. Line up the track horseshoe hanging points with the hanger plates fitted onto the door. Lift the door into position and hook the bolt heads which are fixed to the door onto the slots in the marathon track assembly. Check the clearance gap at the bottom of the door. This should be no less than three millimeters. Ensure that the door is level and sitting at the correct height. You can adjust the height of the door by winding the bolts higher or lower with the spanner. Test that the door is running correctly and smoothly by sliding the door up and down the track. When the door is operating correctly and at the correct height, wind the nuts on the bolts up the hanger assembly and lock off with a spanner. Fitting the stops. Now we need to attach the stops so that the door doesn't run out of the track in operation. Locate a suitable position on the wall for the stops and fix them into place.
fitting the guide to the floor. Once the door is in place, we need to fit the floor guide. Position the guide centrally under the door and mark out the pilot hole positions. Drill the pilot holes with the electric drill if necessary. Using the electric or manual screwdriver, use the screws provided in the kit to secure the guide to the floor. Final adjustment. Add a small amount of the supplied grease to each of the ball bearings. And operate the door to work the grease into the mechanism. Remove any excess grease if necessary. Additional accessories such as locks and handles are available for this system. Visit www.pchenderson.com for more information.